Today we are here at Blackie Spit in South Surrey and we will be going on a Filipino birding walk for the Filipino community. Traditionally, birding is not a, a popular Filipino activity and so having an event like this really is good to welcome people who want to learn more about birds and just spend time in nature in general. I thought I was odd for being like a Filipino birder, but it turns out there's a lot of uh, bird curious Filipinos and they just needed an opportunity to go and uh, go for a birding walk and see what's out there. I was always one of those kids who was in, kind of obsessed with bugs and reptiles and dinosaurs and um, all the fun animals. <laughs> and so, yeah, when our family moved here from the Philippines, it was something I could, I could pursue, and so I did. There's just so much so much to see out there and there's so many amazing stories and adaptations and diversity so it's to me that's always been the most interesting thing ever <laughs> it's, it's such a special spot that ooh, nature like this is so accessible there's so much birds around us and it's so diverse and it's you know, a 10 minute drive from the city. And it really is a privilege just to be out here and be able to experience birds this close. When you go to your local park, you might always see something uh, different. And so there's always that little bit of mystery to it. Like, oh, should I go out today? I'm feeling lazy. But if you do, you might see something special, like a Western grebe. <laughs> Birding is for everybody, and it's important that we not only say that we welcome people of color into the birding community, I think it's important that we do that as well by having walks like this. Also meeting people from the BIPOC community who are also uh, birders, it's, it's great. You know, it's not just, before I was just, oh, I'm kind of that odd one, but you realize there's so many more people like you and you can just connect with them. It really is a, a huge privilege to be able to share what you love. 